we want to graph the quadratic function now that is in vertex form. Remember, our vertex form means that we're in y equals a x minus h squared plus k. Uh, so right there, our vertex is the first thing that we can spot. Vertex is equal to uh, negative 1 comma 3. So let's go ahead and plot that. Negative 1, 3 right there. My axis of symmetry is right off the vertex now, just the way it was before, uh, only, the, uh, only the reverse. In standard form, we had the axis of symmetry and got the vertex. This way, we, this time we have the vertex. And the axis, x is equal to negative 1, comes right from that x coordinate right there. So we're going to plot the, the axis of symmetry right there at negative 1. And label it, please. x equals negative 1. All right, from there, uh, we're going to use that a value again. Remember, a equals negative one-third. The negative means it's facing down. And that one-third acts like a slope. It's not a slope, but it acts like it. And it comes down one-third over one. And you just plot those two points right there on both sides. Now, again, we're going to plot a couple more points, x and y, and go beyond two places beyond the axis of symmetry. So at uh, negative 3 and 1, and 1. So when we plug those in, we're going to have um, y is equal to negative 1 third. Uh, th negative 3 plus 1 is negative 2 squared plus 3. So uh, we have negative, uh, negative 2 squared is going to be positive 4, so we have a negative 4 thirds plus 3, but 3 has got to be written as thirds, so it's going to be plus 9 thirds, which is equal to, uh, what do we have, 5 thirds, well, we know where 5 thirds is, that's going to be a little bit, that's going to be 1 and 2 thirds, right, so we're going to plot that point at uh, negative 3, 1 and 2 thirds, which is right here, so this is it's a fairly wide parabola. Now, we are going to uh, do the same thing with, with 1. And we'll plug that in over here. We get y is equal to negative 1 third. 1 plus 1 is 2. Squared is 4 plus 3. And as you can see, we ended up with the same equation as I had before, negative 4 thirds plus 3, which is 9 thirds. And we'll end up with, again, 5 thirds. So we're going to plot that. And, and it should have come out that way, but you want to check your arithmetic. And so we've got a nice wide parabola. Looks like that. Now we've graphed, uh, we've labeled the vertex, the axis of symmetry. The vertex we know is uh, negative 1, comma 3.